Now, before um, I actually take the sorbet, the set sorbet, I had uh, set it last night um, for your benefit. Now, um, before doing that, actually, I'm going to decorate the glasses or the cocktail glasses, which I am um, going to serve it in. So, um, very, very simple. Let me just take these glasses. Okay, these are real good cocktail, cocktail glasses. For the strawberry sorbet, I will use a strawberry. For uh, the coconut sorbet, I'll use some coconut water. Okay, coconut water or lime juice, anything, no problem. And some sugar, some sugar. Now, I have showed you my um, frosting technique. I'm sure you all know it by now. Um, very, very simple. I've showed it to you with lime juice. Now I'm going to do it with a strawberry. Okay, just very simply, just go round the edges. Don't press too much. We don't want the juice to go right in, okay? Just touch the rim of the uh, glass and go round like so. And then dip it into some granulated or caster sugar. Okay, so it gives you a nice decorative effect. You don't have to do this, but appearance and um, the presentation really counts when you give something to someone, or even if you eat it. It really makes your uh, mind happy. You feel good about it. That extra, that little extra effort is going to go a long way. And there we have a frosted glass. It's so beautiful, isn't it? Because it's, um, it's got this red and white because I'm going to do a strawberry uh, sorbet in it. Now, I'm going to do um, for the coconut sorbet. Hmm? Uh, just This is um, a little bit of coconut wa water, not milk, it's coconut water. You can use coconut milk too, but here I had a little bit of coconut water. So... I'm going to use that. Make sure that um, you dip the rim of the cocktail glass with the coconut water. Then slowly dip it into the granulated or caster sugar. Okay? Don't use icing sugar. It won't work. Okay? Icing sugar will just dissolve in uh, the medium, acid medium, or whatever, okay, strawberry, lime juice, coconut water, whatever you're using. Don't use uh, icing sugar. Make sure you use granulated or caustic. I think granulated sugar is beautiful. Fine granulated sugar will give you that beautiful crystal effect, which goes along with the icy uh, concept, okay? Now my glasses are all decorated well. I'm going to go to the refrigerator, take my sorbets, and I have to process it. Wait. there and I'm ready to process it. This is my coconut uh, sorbet and this is my uh, strawberry sorbet. Mm. No calories, very good for you except for the sugar. Okay, now I'm going to process this very carefully. Wow, looks lovely. Mm. Now, you can process it like this and then keep it in the refrigerator again to harden for around one, two hours. Then process it again. It'll, give you, it'll be really smooth and really icy. Okay, but here I'm just going to process it once because I don't have the time for, to do that. You can do it as you have. Okay, so this is done and I'm going to serve it in. Hmm, lovely. By the way, no color, no artificial additives. This is pure strawberry, pure color. Everything is pure, okay? So it's totally healthy. Very good for people like me who love sweet things, but 
want to keep our figures. Mm, lovely. Okay, and now I need to wash this and I need to do the um, coconut one. Now I've taken out my uh, coconut uh, sobe. Now this, under my ca camera lights, it's really, really hot out here and it's really melting. So I have to be very quick about it. I'm gonna keep this, the strawberry sorbet inside the, ref uh, the freezer, okay? Okay. And here I have my coconut sorbet. Now, like I said, this has really been, it's really uh, melted now because of the camera lights and it's very, very hot. Okay, now for the coconut sorbet. It's, it's really melting fast because of the lights. But um, in the comfort of your house, it's easy for you. Okay. Now, remember I had kept my uh, strawberry sorbet in the refrigerator. Now I'll take it out. Okay. There. And both are ready. My coconut sorbet, my uh, strawberry sorbet, I'm going to have it quick because this is going to melt. So you go have a lovely time and I'm going to have this.